Hello everyone, and welcome back to Mystery Scoop. This video will show you that not only men can be war heroes, but women too. It has been said that wars are a man's game and have been associated as a male activity. However, with those brave men, there can always be some warrior women heroes, whether it be in the front line or the home front. The story of Maria Octaya Braskaya will convince you of their prominence. Maria's husband was killed in action of 1941 during World War II on the Eastern Front. In response, Maria sold all of her belongings in order to buy a tank of her own volition, and sent Stalin this letter. My husband was killed in action defending the motherland. I want revenge on the fascist dogs for his death, and for the death of the Soviet people tortured by the fascist barbarians. For this purpose, I've deposited all of my personal savings. 50,000 rubles to the National Bank in order to build a tank. I kindly asked to name the tank Fighting Girlfriend and to send me to the front line as a driver of said tank. The Soviet State Defense Committee were open to the idea, and seeing the value of such actions to Soviet war efforts and morale, they rolled out a brand new T-34 tank just for Maria. After a five-month tank training program, Maria went on to fight the Germans in the Eastern Front as a formidable tank-driving widow. On the 17th of January 1944, however, Maria participated in a night attack as part of the Leningrad-Novgorod offensive, where she was hit in the head by shell fragments. Subsequently falling into a two-month coma, she had succumbed to her injuries and had finally died on the 15th of March 1944 she was posthumously designated a hero of the Soviet Union, equivalent to the Medal of Honor. Now let's move on and see some more badass war heroines, and don't forget to tell us your thoughts in the comments section below.
That's all for today, folks, and thank you for watching.